Welcome back to Spirit Fair. Um, I was just going to buy these upgrades off camera, but then he went and made one of his jokes. But there's an achievement to sit through ten of them, I believe. So I might as well get all of them, as many of them as I can. I got gun, dad, 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 dad. Get as many of them as I can on camera. I hope there's a mirror in that cellar of yours. Because it's looking Gouda. <laughs> oh, hey! You can jerk ten of Albert's joke achievement. Speak of the devil, talk about the shipyard Stella, I'll tell you what you need to do. Upgrade. We have everything here, we sure do. And then we go BAM! We are now colossal sized. And then we go BAM! And now we go faster. And once we get 25 more XP potions, we'll go faster. Awesome. Rah 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 rah! I like his laugh. Jovial. All right, people want to chat. Oh, hey, you're happy. That's good. I like that you're happy. Whoa, Commander! This is utterly fantastic. The Silver Company has answered the call once again. We will soon traipse once more on the Elysium Fields of Adventure. May the Eleven Stars bless your heart, Commander. You truly have been indomitable herald of bravery. Now our next step will lead us to a shifty tavern. The naked Mulberrian nested in the frozen mist of the white hamlet of Nordweller. But before our appearance at the mysterious premises, there is a little something we should accomplish, Commander. I certainly am entertaining the concept of sustenance. Yeah, we, we cannot come empty-handed. That would be a good idea. Uh, okay, look. We should bring some munchies. Otherwise, everyone will be miserable. Let's say some popcorn, corn dog. Uh, ooh, toffee. That should do it. All right, where was I already? Oh, yeah. I turned into a jarhead voice for some reason. This undertaking must very well be below your level, Commander, but it shall be a well-earned respite from our class qua qua quest for justice and glory. Onward! Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold, let me just... Do, 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 popcorn? That popcorn smells great! Man, Byron won't stop talking about it. Great. Good. Wonderful. Could you just start me here next time? There's so many things. Uh, fish sticks. Corn dog! Right on, some good corn dogs! Jerome and I all don't always agree, but our friendship has been cemented by our mutual love of corn dogs. Awesome, awesome, good. Corn dogs is fantastic. Is. Corn dogs are fantastic. You know what I meant. Everyone understands what I'm saying, even though it's gibberish. What does toffee look like? There it is! That toffee is perfect. Wow, it looks so yummy. Bob will be delighted. Wonderful job. Yay, Stella. You've got everything. Oh, damn, sorry. Um, uh, by the lords of Wayron, our fellowship's larder has now been filled up to the brim with delectable victuals. Victuals? Commander, victory won't have been simply earned in the battlefield, but in the kitchen, too. Now, let's soar swiftly and sprucely to the modest hamlet of Nordweller. The Silver Company is bustling with... Bursting. Bursting. With impatience. The naked mole bear's walls will forever see the stones imprinted the memories of our... Give the order, Commander. Fade away. Huh. Somewhere along the way, it became difficult to do this voice. And now it sounds like I'm a really weird radio host. Would you listen to that? Uh, I just remembered we... Have new flowers. Um, a fennel flower, Bruce's spirit flower, it can be used to upgrade your boat. And a delicate red anomian. 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 The flower she forgot. That sound. Oh dear, what is this? Oh, I've burnt the food! That's a shame. Might as well hold on to that. Looks the same, but is not a failed experiment. So, I've got a great idea! Now that we found some volunteers, we just need to find a place for the play. I was thinking that big city, Oxbury. All those lights, all those buildings, it'll be awesome! Alright. Duh. Duh, this one. Give me the sauerkraut. Alright. Where are we right now? We're at Alfred's. Albert. Albert's. We should head. Either Oxbury or Nordweller. I think Oxbury is probably the better call. For reasons I will not be sharing. Whoop. <clears throat> I 
So, did you watch the loop of sport? You know, let's find something else to do. I'm sure there's something we can do around the ship. What do we have for things to make? We have so Uh, <laughs> uh, let's feed the chickens. They don't need fucking anything, but let's give them some more anyway. I've already upgraded them, so they're more efficient. I bought the last upgrade for um, Bruce's house. Stella! Hello. Stella, Stella, Stella! Guess what? They finally corrected the second module of the weapon manual! They added the critical tables and the finesse weapons that clarified the rules of engagement. Right when I was about to call it quits on War of Worms. You know, I was legit worried that I would go down to 2.5 edition path. Yeah, I know, I'm not mincing words. Remember how they modified the spellcasting system? <laughs> as if W and W was a kid's game, such as Sorcery the Reunion. <laughs> Man, even after all these years, I'm still so mad at that. I understand being that in love with something. I truly do. Do anything else just need sustenance? Some stack salad, do you want some? Whoa! You just... But those... What? I thought those... I'm so confused. So very confused. But I'm at full HP. This won't be necessary. Okay. It really ruins a day, doesn't it? I... No. No. As a D&D &D nerd, I feel like... Well, I mean, my experience with D and D nerds is normally they are shut ins and rain pushes people in more and you get less flack for being indoors when it's raining, and that helped as a child to really reinforce the love of the rain. Because it was the only time the parents weren't like, Why aren't you outside doing something that makes me feel like a better parent? Because you're not a better parent, I'm sorry, that's just how that works. Am I just working through trauma in a video game right now? What's happening? Nobody saw that. It didn't happen. Did that plant grow a little bit? I feel like it grew a little bit. I feel like it's bigger. Might be a little bit bigger. Do I want to cook something? We don't have any wood, right? I sold all of that. Yeah. Yeah, it did. It didn't really... Oh, we wanted to talk to Francis. Right. Well, he'll be back. He doesn't really not hang out. You know what makes um, getting fire glow bugs real easy? This. There's like a lot of... Uh, woo -hoo. Oh wow, there's so much more space now. Ah, the comets. The music, the lighting, everything is so pretty. This game... Ugh. I doubt any of the creators will see my videos, because I'm small time and that's fine. But, like, if they do... Well done. It's beautiful. I love it. It's one of the few games that I put into the category of not just proving that video games are art, but are the very definition of video games. Like, artist art video games. Really good. Not using words good. Hold on. What am I trying to say? It's very, these are the representations of just how artistic video games can be. Like, yes, um, you can have a shooter game and have it be artistic. Spec Ops The Line is a very good example of that. It's so, so good. Whoa. Okay. We're up here. Why are you sad? He's hungry. Have a strawberry. Oh, wait. Sustenance contains fruit, doesn't it? Sorry, Commander, I unfortunately cannot accept your generous donation. Fruit are sacred according to the holy scriptures of Dorum, of which I am pious follower. Is only forbidden for me to think that f can I just my face. Yes, my face. Okay. Clamps? Humble thanks. Sustenance is right on time. My hunger is reaching level one. Great. So doesn't like fruit. Really? 
know you're eating pizza, so chances are you are not lactose intolerant. It must be someone else. Okay. Alright, let's go. Cool, here we are. I'm so excited! This is gonna be the best! Are you ready to watch my play? Sure. Get ready! Unhappy. There's a girl with a big hat. She's tall. She runs around everywhere. She does everything. There's this big gate. It's huge. It's shiny. And where is it? Where is it anyways? That, that girl knows. Because when you're ready, she takes you. Then you leave with her. It's long. Everyone else is sad. Then, then boom. Preposterous. Big lights. And a, a big rumble. Explosion. Wind. Dust. Smoke everywhere. Everything is quiet for a second. Oh, no. Then we don't get to see our friend again. That's when the real pain starts. The end. Thank you for coming! Good job, buddy. I can't move. At all. So apparently that was that entire activity. Wonderful. Let's head to Nordwell. Oh yeah, we need XP potions so we can go in some master. Or we could No. That is a mission for another time. Nordwell! Over here, right? Nope. There it is. Let's take the bus. It's not really a bus, we're taking the seal. Um, but that doesn't quite have the same look to it. If we're being honest. Whoa! So many things. I don't need any of you, but I don't like having you on my ship. My ADHD tells me to collect you. Alright, I'm running fast. Aha! Sorry, boat. I know you're trying to go, but uh, I'm promise I'm not gaslighting you on purpose. <laughs> Don't question it. Whoop. And whoop. And whoop. Right. Where do we want to go now? Yeah, sure. Grow another wheat. Bring that down to five. And that. Was that a tomato? Probably a tomato. We're going to go through some rain. Hey, tea leaves. Sold up. What load of those? We're not going to go through rain, right? We're teleporting. Sorry. Taking the bus. Let's go. Right here, please. We're still going to have to the rain, though, because Lord Weller's in the rain. In the snow. I don't know if it has the same effect. We're going to find out. That's not what I wanted. Why did I? There was there was an up. Why did up? Why did why was up? Whoop! Uh, da, da, da. Goodbye, bus stop. Should we be going past any time now? Bye, buddy. You keep being you, man. I may not enjoy the music you're making, but I can respect the shit out of the fact that you're making it. Have some sauerkraut. I can't see why a cow wouldn't want pickled cabbage. Fermented cabbage. Milk! I don't know why I feel the need to do everything all the time. I just... We're here. I might as well run around and do stuff. Whoops! Way too far. Alright. Fuck! It's time for D&D! Chop, chop! for someone. Hello, friend. Wait. I need something. Do you happen to have... No, you do not. Goodbye. Da, 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 da. Commander. Sometimes, great events happen in the simplest of places. The air is damp with mead fumes. The atmosphere is tense and the onlookers gaze at your appearance. The naked mulberry inn is a shabby parlor indeed. It's inconspicuous. It's, it's, it's inconspicuousness is its best quality. A lot of people lost eyes here. You can smell the bloodshed in the air. 
the perfect rendezvous for the Silver Company. And indeed, our reunited Avengers each came forth with a piece of intricate scenario. Wardrick the Bard in his research found an ancient tome in the Elder Archives of the Great Library of Wallalabul. In it, words of a very wise and ancient being, an oracle, have been mentioned by the sages of wa Iran. Elpern, the noble ranger, met with witches' conclaves of Samdara. The witches talked about the leaves of the Elder Tree. And though their forbidden ritual of Almazar awakened the tree from its ageless slumber, slumber. And finally, Emdril, riding his white steed, Emdril... Emdril did nothing but argue on the internet over the merits of the Poison Cloud spell cast at level 2. Good job, Jerome, once again. Commander, the Sim Silver Company might have unearthed what our next step will be. Roll a knowledge check. 18. Success. You can't shake the idea that the Oracle is indeed hidden in Furugawa. This can be the only possible solution. Determined, you believe it's time to set sail towards Furugawa to the Oracle. Well, all right. Bye, D&D friends. Glad you showed up. Have fun being up there forever, I guess. Don't know how you guys get around. There's not many boats, so... Francis? Nope. I thought I heard Francis make a noise, but I guess it was Buck squeaking. Why are you always here? Your house is... Whatever. The Oracle is being of immense wisdom. Only the Chosen will be deemed worthy. You'll have to force the face the Oracle alone. He's as old as time. Watching all of us mortals. You can find him in Furugawa. Find the Oracle. Okie dokie. Whoop. Sedoodles. Uh, alright, so. No, no. Uh, Furugawa, Furugawa. Well, let's go to Furugawa. Where is Furugawa? I think it's over here, right? Ah, right there. Well, back to the bus stop. When filming, it's just easier. Ooh, something's finished. Probably eggs, since the only way to stop producing eggs is to starve the chickens. And why? I just don't like the feeling seeing this thing very clearly empty and saying, hey, 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 this fucker's not feeding his chickens. Look at him. Look at him being a monster. <laughs> I don't know why anyone would say it like that, but that's how they're saying it in my head. That's how people talk about it. When my back is turned. Maybe I'm crazy. Oh, there's Stanley. Going for a run. I thought I heard him thumping around. Oh, yes. I'm back. Did you miss me? I hope so. Uh, yeah, right there. Great. Boop. Off we go. Ha-ha. Fantacular. Swell. Thanks, friend. Now, that is quite the move. Very pretty. Yeah. There's also a chest here we haven't unlocked yet. I wonder if I have the way to do that now. Hello? Stand? Oh, yes. That's probably advancing now. That makes sense. <coughs> Stanley. What's up, buddy? Ta-da! That was amazing, right? I'm sure everyone liked it. Please, Stella, go and ask around. But wait, 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 wait. Don't flat out ask about it. Don't make it too obvious. Be cool, big head. Hey guys, you like the play? You in, uh, you in bed? Nope. Oop. Did I just see you? Nope. I don't know why I thought that was... That, that. Oh, Buck's in bed. Wake up! Never mind. Didn't work. Where is Elena? Where does Elena even hang out? She just kind of... Wanders. Hey, Stanley. Bucks going away. Makes sense that Elena would be up at the crack of dawn. Or just isn't on my boat anymore. Food time. Yeah, alright. So hungry, I could eat a horse. No two horses. Cats up, pick a horse. Would you enter an oven? Yes. All of those things are absolutely correct. 
Um, cheese sticks. Whoa, thanks. This is so good. Here you go. Glad I could help out. Is it? Yeah, I'm glad that I could help out. This is not what I want. Get off of there. Down we go. Let's go find the oracle. Also figure out where Elena went. Maybe she... It's like, you know what? This They forced me to go to this play. I'm done. I'm out. Gone. Never coming back. Bye, friend. I never, don't think I've ever seen them use ladders before. That can't be right. I feel like I have in the past. Eh. Feel amazing. Sacred dog feels so brazen. Okie doke. There's... I feel like the oracle's gonna be in a house. Right? The rice patch needs constant nurturing. It's a full-time job. Well... Let's see. Oh, different color. You, you're colored different. Where's the oracle? Can't be far. I can feel his power. Okay. No, thank you. I don't want to buy your magazine solution or whatever you're selling. I am the oracle. I see visions of deception and hardship. I see loss, sorrow, and pain. I see hope, love, and joy. You will return to the world with a token of passage. A piece of soul already paid. An item of immense value. An obel. But spirit fair, this is not what you come here for. You came here seeking answers. You will find these answers in the simple numbers. <laughs> Negative. Okay, I'm just going to write those down just in case. It doesn't tell me them in the quest. It's usually good about that, so I think I'll be fine. But, <laughs> sometimes, sometimes i not okay. All right, there we go. Those symbols will show you the way. The receptacle of light awaits. Something about... Si yeah, okay, so I think that was uh, that was Buck doing his DM impression of the Oracle. That's why it's hitting my stuff. Well done, Buck. I, uh, I like it. And that's him paying for his his, uh, his ship drive. Because that's what you need the old ship drive. His passage. Amazing. Commander, this day will forever be inscribed in the archives of yore. Forever sung by the ball uh, balladeers of the Seven Corners. The Oracle has awakened. He talked to you. His puzzle may be cryptic, but you will no doubt find the solution. Of this, I'm sure. Roll. Oh, well. No, nah, I think he can make this one out ground. Good luck. Thanks, man. Let's go. I think he's right, though. I think I think we've got this. Demons of light. Um. Yeah, we'll look at on that first. Let's go find that location. So. Negative. 185 is way the hell over here. 192 is right there. Bam. Boop, boop. This is going to be a long drive. Ooh, they might go through some sections that we aren't actually allowed to go through. Let's just ignore it. Deal with it when we come to it. But first. Buck, Elena, aha! You, let's feed you first. That might make things better. You want something? Have a strawberry. I will always be eating healthy. Good, good, good. What's up? Don't tell that child. He's not ready for the limelight. That's why I don't teach children. They whine and scream and think they're good at things, which they are not. But telling them would be devastating. So I just don't interact. With them. Honestly, man. Full, full points. I get it. It's the whole, if you can't say anything nice, don't say anything at all rule. I, I understand some people just don't have the temperament for children. I'm one of them. Let's feed you as well. Um, you have, you know what? Let's find something dairy. It's got one. According to Dorham's teaching fruit... Oh, right, fruit. <laughs> Yogurt. Commander, I cannot accept a generous offer as I cross paths with him. Lactogroth, the knob goblin. Cursed me out of jealousy and a dreadful level of three lactose intolerance. Yeah, it's a conjuration ritual. I won't talk about what happens if I just small stuff staring. Cool. There we go. Now we learn to think. Have... 
Tuna. Thank you. Fantastic. I'm going to level one. Great. That was a bit boring. No wizards, no dragons, no traps, no elves. Not for me, sorry. But that child has guts and imagination. He will no doubt be a great dungeon master in a few years. That's actually, that's good. That's good advice. You're a good dude. I knew he would have something positive to say. Just like, yeah, man, that wasn't for me. But you got chops. I respect that. What'd they say? Really? Really? They all said they liked it? Really, really, really liked it? Are you sure, Big Hat? I don't know. I'm just not convinced. I, I can see it on your face. They they told you they liked it, but it was not good. It was terrible, and I didn't do it right. I know it. Even if they try to hide it, they just can't do nothing right. They'll never make another play. I hate it. This is why Elena didn't get to talk to Stanley. Because I feel like it would have been worse. But Elena knew that, and I respect that. I respect the shit of that. You could. I mean, I guess that is really the fastest way for you, huh? The rounds. Huh. Well, we're just going to let him have some time. When do I get to make XP potions? Because that'd be just great. Anytime. It's progress. Just cutting a swath through the darkness. Ooh, look, an island. What's that? You're not gonna... Yeah, you're allowed to give me the highlight. Tell me what I see. Well, I guess I don't get to find out. Something hidden, though. And I think we're gonna end our episode on this hidden island. Hidden shrine! Shrine! Well... Interesting, just so happens I have ovals. To the shrine! Look at this a dash. Because I need dash for Elena. Um... The oracle words were true. Commander, those dark woods conceal a shrine of immense power. Old and ancient shrines have a will of their own. Imbued with the divine power of Hel Halteron the Wise, they only reveal themselves to the true heir of Ramalda. Ramalda. It is your rest. Only you, the Chosen One, can resonate with its magic. Only you, the Star Child, can wield the glaive of divine justice. Go, Commander. Cast your heavenly magic and whisper the secret words. May your actions enlighten our path. May the light shine. Advantage on your skill check. Okay. Whoop. Da da da. da. Whoop. Light burst. Press key to. Ooh. Burst in all directions. Neat. I have seven obols. How did this happen? I mean, I know I've been bringing in people. Wow. I've, that animation feels. Different, but I guess it's just been a while since I saw the animation for that. Awesome. Whoop. Whoop. Oh, I guess that's a cooldown. Neat. Blessed by the eleven stars, you definitely are the chosen one, the light bringer, the sun bringer. She who shall enlighten our souls and liberate our conscience drenched in shadow. That power bestowed upon you by the very fabric of this world will be our weapon. A weapon whose power will rival the thrice-forged glaive of Ethildor, the first of the dollars. Alas, this party must split up now. The Silver Company has played its role fully, and it is time for its members to ride back to their homesteads. Also, these guys are past their refusing to get back home. Let's track back to the Galleon, where I shall describe our next task in great lore-dumping details. Also, I need to go look at my notes. Sounds good. Let's go look at your notes. Huzzah! So, we're going to go back to the ship and look at his notes. Because he should... Perfect. Marked it. Great. So that means I know to, to, to do that. Because we're ending the episode here. That's right. Whoa. Morning, Lily. Let's give Lily a hug.
But yes, that's going to be that. Um, in the next episode, we're going to... Oh! In the next episode. No, I'll do it later. There's still one fish to catch. And he's near the Misty Woods, which is up near another place we have to go. So, in the next episode, we're going to go get a sublime figurine. But we're also not going to do that. I should probably look into that. Because I didn't... I didn't do that. I'm going to find out what abilities I'm missing and write them here for their location so that this is a dealt with. It's going to be great for later. For now, you guys have yourselves a wonderful night.